Hello, dear students, I am S. K. Nayak. In this video, I am going to discuss with you case study based question in mathematics for class 10th, particular chapter real numbers. So, let us start the question. The question is a seminar is being conducted by an educational organization where the participants will be educator of different subjects. The number of participants in Hindi, English, and mathematics are 60. 84 and 108 respectively. So, from this paragraph, how many type of question you can frame and or you can discuss? Let me take question number one. In each room of the same number, participants are to be seated and all of them being in the same subject, hence maximum number participants that can accommodate it in each room are dear students very simple clue i would like to give you if we find the sc of 60 84 and 108 we will get the maximum number of participants that can be accommodated in each room it means if there are greatest or maximum words are there so generally we will find out the hcf so what will be the sc of 60 84 and 108 by the factor prime factorization method it is 12 your option B is correct. Second question, what is the minimum number of rooms required during the event? Very good question. If you think one room will have 12 participants on the same subject, so we have to calculate the rooms required for each subject separately. That means total rooms 60 for one subject, 84 for second subject students and 108 for third subject and that this this sum will be divided by 12 so the number is 21 21 rooms required there which option is correct d option is correct if you find out correct answer or wrong answer then please write in the comment box let's we take question number three direct question is there lcm of these three number is so factorization of 60 are 84 and 108 ka factorization kiya lcm mein aap achhi tarah jante hain 2 is 2 2 is 2 time common 3 is 1 time common then the remaining numbers are here multiple when you multiply these all numbers then you will get 3780 so which option is correct i think option a is correct now take fourth question the product of hcm and lcm so in the second part uh, first part we find out hcf I think uh, 12 and LCM is 3780. Then the product of these two numbers 12 and 3780 is 45360. Which option is correct? I think it's D option is the correct. So you have to deal the question carefully. If there is case study based question, then there is no problem. I would like to thank you all of you and take care of yourself and all the best for your examination.